All right, what is going on guys? Hope you guys are doing good. Been a minute since I picked up this camera, but we're back at it in the shop. We got the Beamer in here. I just pulled it in. And also we got, uh, got Sebastian over here. What up, mate? I'm not gonna show what, what he's working on, but- A little uh, top secret project, you know? Geez, you're ready. What are you Come, doing to it? Coming out soon, we're getting matching camber. Ooh. Big camber, big, big, big camber. How, how much are we talking? We're talking about Double digits? Like double digits, double digits. In the, in the 20s? In the, maybe. maybe. I know what y'all want. Oh yeah, That's thank you, you there you go. Gian, just pull up the ES, what's up man? What's good? So, uh, you gonna get rid of the ES today, maybe, or what? Uh, I don't know about today, but soon. Oh, oh yeah, you're not gonna trade it. You're yeah, yeah. It. Soon the ES will be saying bye-bye. Probably gonna keep the spinners though. Have to, yeah. you have to. They're, but, going, they're going the next thing probably for a little <laughs> bit. We'll see. But you are picking up today something, maybe, right? You, yeah, you, yeah, maybe. Hopefully, you know, go grab yeah. something new. You know what I'm saying? Something that we all need for real. Yeah. To expand sure. like business, everything straight up. Yeah. So, we'll, 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 we'll show you we'll guys. Let you know. yeah. yeah, yeah. We don't want to talk too soon before shit happens. Yeah. You know? We'll let it happen and then we'll talk. So we got a full shop today. We got the Beamer. We got, I can't, even, can't even talk on that. But uh, my boy's doing a breaks. Yeah, you know. Quick little break job. On the daily. You know. <laughs> hey, don't show these niggas that. <laughs> he was telling me too. Oh my yeah, god. It's that time. It's that time. It's that time. It's all right, man. It's all right. It's all right. It'd be like that. Hey, when you're the mechanic, your car is always the fucking worst. That's not my time working on everybody else's shit. I'm about to take off the wheel, and we're gonna try to remove the black paint. As you guys heard me, I've been complaining about these black wheels. I think they would look a lot better if they were like silverish. So I'm gonna take off the paint. And then if we have to, probably end up painting them as well. But uh, we'll see how it looks after we remove the paint. All right, so I'm gonna try this out. It's kind of like aircraft remover, so we'll see. It's, it's pretty much gonna remove it to like the very base layer, so. All right, so we're gonna let that sit on there for about 15 minutes. It's already eating up the paint. All right, so this is how we're looking, guys. The paint is coming off really easily. You can see I'm scraping it with just some uh, cardboard. But I'm using like an actual scraper. My brush is not working. It's like gooey, so the bristles, it's all stuck in the bristles, so it's like not working. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna just have to scrape it off, but it's coming off. I think it's gonna look really good. I think just silver or polished or however it comes out, I think it's gonna look really good, so. I'm hyped, it's just gonna take a long time. Hey, wh what are you doing there? Uh, oh, hello, by the way, Mike. What's going on? Yeah, that's, uh, a nice, that's a nice tire machine. It is, so I gotta catch the flip. Is that your supervisor? Yeah. Yes, sir. Make sure it's straight. Paddle? <laughs> Make sure my shape's <laughs> straight. All of a sudden. All of a sudden, we have a tire machine. All, all of a sudden, just casually oh. using a tire machine. Just, ca just casually. My boy stopped by and he's like, hey, yeah, yeah, I need to use a tire machine. I need my flip, so, you know, just, just pop by. So we're back at the shop and remember I had put the uh, aircraft remover on the wheels. I didn't go with that. I just ended up uh, with the wire wheel and just grinding it down. It looks a lot better. You see the vision. You see the silver. Um, still got a lot of black in the crevices. These wheels are kind of uh, annoying because all the spokes. But you, yeah, it looks way better than black. Still gotta finish those up. Remember we said Gian was gonna look at a Yukon? Well, he, he got a Silverado instead. Nah. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Uh, they just knocked out yet another uh, Starlight headliner install. I'll show you guys once uh, the truck is on. He has to jump it. That's dead. It's not my fault. Not his fault. Oh, if I'm not a Beamer guy, 
Then, uh, I mean, maybe bends, probably euros, but uh, batteries in the trunk, so there's a positive terminal under the hood. Right there, you just ground it down to whatever. But uh, forgot my keys, we'll see if there's enough keys. Oh. All right, so my battery is weak. I'm gonna jump it with the Denali. Denali. We'll, we'll talk about it more once we got some more daylight. Yeah, yeah, exactly. We'll yeah. talk about it. Forever. And it's not raining. We just, we're just here at the shop real quick. It's uh, it's also New Year's Eve, so you know we have our plans later. Just came here real quick for the shop. You know, one time, one last time before the New Year. But hope you guys are being safe out there. I'll probably upload this. Hopefully not too. Nah, hopefully not like the fifth, you know. Hopefully like the first or second soon after the new year, but uh. All right, what is up guys? So it's a couple days later, we're back at the shop. We're at Jesse, Jesse pulled up. Gian's here again. So we just finished up a car right now. We did a radiator. I was gonna work on the uh, Beamer. We're gonna continue sanding down those wheels. You can see they're coming along. Still need a, a lot of work to go, but uh. But right now, one of our homies sounds like his actual, yeah. It sounds like his axle just went out. Um, so we're gonna go save him. And I did show, I was gonna, I did say I was gonna show you guys the new rig that Gian just picked up. Show you guys, talk about it. The new tow rig for the shop. Ready for it to use. It's already like a second tow. Second tow. Alright guys, so if you don't know, Chevy makes Yukon and the GMC has the Yukon Denali. Yes sir. And they make it more luxurious. Um, we'll show you in a second, but these brand new, how much how much are they about I like? Think they're like between 60, 65, 75k, brand new. Yeah, they're back up in there. 07. 07, yeah. So I mean honestly the body style is still really nice. I mean it doesn't look old at they all. They haven't for, changed much. Yeah, 07. No. But how much did you pick it up for? Five grand. Five grand. Yeah. You know, she needs a little love. We're gonna swap out the interior, put all black in there. She's got some dings and dangs, but for five bands. For $5,000. I'm not even tripping. What else are you gonna get that fits seven people, has a 7,500 towing capacity, a luxurious 6.2 reliable V8. Yeah, but LS. For 5,000. Seven, eight, I don't know. It's. Oh, no, seven, yeah, seven. Let's, let, let's, take a, let's take a ride in it. I'm so down. Sheesh, the towing rig. <laughs> Follow, 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 like that. Huh? I think it'll make it up. Is it gonna make it up? Yeah. Stands towing. Stands towing. Stands towing. Uh, what happened, bro? You good? I'm chilling, dude. You good? It's all good. Okay. We're here to save you. Thank you, guys. But with style. Oh, the new owner of the ES. Oh yeah, if you guys don't know, Gian sold it to uh, Chris, so he's the, he's the new owner of the ES now. He stays in the family. Went to a good home. And Alexis. 
Wow, put it in the right hole, Jesse. Ah. Alright guys, so that's a wrap. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. So I know I kind of lagged it these past couple weeks. It was the holidays and everything, but it's a new year. So I really want to get on top of the vlogs. Want to upload at least once a week at the very least. But yeah, I'm very excited. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. We have a tow rig now. We have a tire machine. So we're going to start off the new year right. I'm really excited to drop these vlogs. But uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please drop a thumbs up for me. It really helps me out with the channel. And if you guys are new, please consider subscribing. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.